What is going on everybody? It's Mark here with another video and today I have something that raises my excitement just a tad. Today I'm going to turn my iPad into a secondary display. I don't know why I'm so excited about this. Maybe because my productivity when I'm on the move will go up like exponentially. Two monitors is the best thing possible for anyone. And I believe there are a few apps that do this, but today I'm going to use the one called Do It Display. So first thing first, as always, is we have to install the app. App Store, boom. D-U-E-T, display. Search. Boom, there we go. This app does cost $27.99 Canadian. I'm not sure what that is, American. Here we go, here we go. Bye. There we go. Now we play the waiting game. Open Duet. Hello, let's get started. Next, install Duet from your Mac or PC. Conveniently enough, I have brought my computer. Duet, display. Excuse me. Happens to be one of the uh, giveaway items. Okay, back to this. Download Mac. Yep, here we go. Here we go. One minute left. Do it. Open, authorize, and install. Okay, okay, here we go. I'm excited. Restart my Mac. Okay, so I guess that is installed now. Now we can move on with the next process here. Okay, we've launched the application in both my computer and my iPad. So the next step I have to do. Okay, let's set this up like a real dual monitor here. Like I would in the real world. I'm excited. Launching Duet. What? What? And it's touch screen? Oh, that is awesome. Holy moly. And there's literally no lag. Oh. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Let's open up, uh, let's open up Chrome here. Let's move it to this window. Can we full screen here? Yeah, we can full screen into the iPad. It's literally a secondary display, like 100%. There's no like, it's, it's a weird resolution, but 100% a functional display. What? Okay, let's watch a video. Let's, let's, see, uh, let's see how this resolution looks. What is going on everybody? It's Mark here with another video. And today, there's a change. For those old school guys, you know this setup. For the ones who just joined, this is where it all started. I've also changed the lens setup, so let me know. You know what? That's surprisingly good. I mean, I'm not expecting like next level HD format shenanigans here. Like this isn't 4K or anything, but this is, this is awesome. I can't believe how, like, I was expecting some sort of difference with iPad, like some restrictions that I couldn't do. But I mean, it's fully functional. Let's, let's, let's try uh, Final Cut here. I mean, it's a tiny screen, but you can you can fully have one, op one window here, another one there. This could be your editing window. Oh my goodness. The possibilities are literally endless. Nice. This is awesome. This is great. I mean, it's taking up a lot of real estate here. I mean, Maybe if I didn't have the iPad Pro, maybe a little bit of a smaller one. Can you do this on your phone? Where's my phone? Searching for it right now. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Twice the productivity. Use your iPad as a display. Unplug this. Put you off to the side, got it. Conveniently, I have a coffee cup. What? Oh yeah. Can you guys see my mouse? Where's my mouse? Oh, like. Like, there's no lag either. That's crazy. All right, guys. So that was me turning my iPad and my iPhone into a secondary display off my Mac. You can do it for PC as well. So all you Mac haters, don't worry. You're covered too. That app was called Duet Display. I'll have a link down below. No, they didn't sponsor this video. I'm sure there's a bunch of other apps that do very similar things. But for now, as always, thank you very much for watching. And if you guys want some additional brownie points, please hit that like, share, and subscribe button down below. And please follow me on all my social medias. Links in the description. Now today we have our first Q&A, but I have compiled a bunch on my phone and let's knock them off. Let's try to do this fairly quickly. I don't want to bore you guys. Question one, what are you taking in school? Right now I am completing my last year of civil 